Hello and welcome to um, the Amstrad CPC uh, gameplay review of Roland on the Ropes. And I think this was originally called Fred uh, in Spain and then it got converted um, to the Amstrad Ways. That's Roland. An anagram of Arnold. Arnold being the code name for the Android CPC 464 when it was in production. Geeky fact. Um, so we come to this title screen, which is very plain. Uh, as is the music, um, almost childlike. A bit like me, really. And some of the graphics. Um, very blocky, large chunky type graphics. They're very colourful and quite pleasing to the eye really. The only problem is when you start moving uh, it all gets a little bit flickery and this is uh, one of the things about this game is you'll see a lot of that. A lot of artifacts that you don't really want to be looking at. So you see a lot of those in the first level, all those ghosts. And you can try to shoot them to scare them away. Sometimes it works. And the goal of this, you start at the bottom, the goal is to basically just get to the top, find the exit at the top um, and avoid anything that comes your way this ghost no, he's good. might as well just go through him uh, yeah, playing hard now oh, wee. Again, I need to find the uh, key for jumping. Oh. Can do that either. That's not the key for jumping, clearly. So there's a bit of a dead end. Kipper here. And you see that strength bar, which I affectionately call the strengthometer at the bottom. He's not looking good, and that's another dead end. Limited firepower, so it's always good to shoot when there's nothing around. Mm. And sometimes you might as well just let them kill you because they're so close to you. I'll go away. dead ends. Can I care for? Oh, 
Oh no! Should have stayed. Hmm. Shot my gun. As it were. See that? Really? Does that work? No, it doesn't. It has worked before, but I think you got to be on the A list for that. I clearly am not. Oh dear. So, that's the trick of the game, try and remember where you've been and where you're going to. A bit like life really. Alright, so here we go. One more chance. Oh great, ghosty again. In the other levels you get uh, mummies, which you can shoot, and they go up in a puff of smoke. Which is quite a funny animation. Oh, it's following me. Still haven't figured out the uh, jump button yet. Oh dear. And this is quite a rarity really, I mean... I don't often find myself coming across a lot of dead ends, just having a, a cracking day at the office here. I eat those ghosts. slow down there because there's quite a lot happening on the screen. Yeah, he'd be dead. Oh, look. There's the jump key. I've been using it all along. <laughs> oh dear. Little laugh. In my defence, he jumps onto the ropes uh, automatically. Pop them there. Oh, just below, I've got defence team that was useless. So that's rolling on the ropes for you. It's uh, it's a good game. It's a nice, enjoyable play. Um, it's unfortunate about the, the flickering screen. And I think you just see the exit there. See so if I can get there before my time limits up for ten minutes. And there you go. On to the next level. So that's uh, running on the ropes for you for the Australia. It's uh, quite a nice little game.